Takes a three. Touchdown, 49ers. Hurry! Larry Kruger here in the studio talking about Colin Kaepernick opting out. Now, you heard the news of the day, Adam Schefter reporting, Chris Mortensen reporting. What does it mean? It means that nobody's on the hook for $14 million for Colin Kaepernick next year. It doesn't necessarily mean that he won't be back with the 49ers, but I got to think that he wants a fresh start. Uh, and I got to think Kyle Shanahan wants a fresh start with a new quarterback, but you never know. Now, what Kaepernick clearly needs is he needs somebody to work with him on his footwork and on his mechanics so that he can be more accurate in the short and underneath patterns. He's just not accurate on the passes that other quarterbacks, you know, can, can complete with ease. So he needs a quarterback guru. He needed a Bill Walsh. He needs a, a Mike Holmgren. Uh, you know, he needs, you know, he needs maybe, maybe he needs a Kyle Shanahan. But I don't think the 49ers are going to go in that direction. That's just a guess. Now, the talk is, speculation is that Kaepernick may wind up with the New York Jets. But Woody Johnson is a big Trump supporter, and it's hard to envision Woody bringing Kaepernick to New York. It's also hard to envision that working really well. At the end of the day, Colin Kaepernick is still a tough kid. He's still a guy who's won an NFC Championship game. He can rip a 22-yard out or in pattern like any quarterback in the game. He's got great arm strength. He's got great foot speed. But he needs a quarterback guru, and he's probably not going to get a starting job. He's probably going to have to go somewhere and compete uh, with three or four other guys for a spot. He'll be on an NFL roster next year. I don't believe he'll be as a starter.